Hey, hi, hello everybody. Welcome or welcome back to Bougie Budgets where we are always being bougie on a budget. My name's Lambo. Thank you so much for joining me here today. I'm a 22 year old full-time college student. I do have a full-time remote job and I also have a part-time job that I haven't been to in over five months now because I injured myself. I do cash flow school and I live on my own in a one bedroom with some fuzzy friends. So if any of that interests you, consider hitting that subscribe button. Today I'm going to be doing my weekly cash envelope stuffing so we can see how much money I have and where it's all going to go. So without further ado, I'm going to get right on into it by just counting the cash so we have one and two hundred dollars in placeholders 250 270 290 300 310 320 330 340 and 345 here today so yes i definitely have some more 100 dollars placeholders than what i usually have because i am a broke college kid okay you guys don't forget <laughs> so i guess i don't know i guess i do have like a little bit more money than the average 22 year old but i also do work a lot and so that's why i'm able to have the money that i do have so let's just get right on into it we're going to go ahead and start off with our small cash binder this is my daily or weekly cash binder so we are going to start off with my dog she will be getting ten dollars this week and her envelope is definitely getting it's definitely getting there that's for sure so yeah let me just put 10 in here so now she has 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 71, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. So $76 for her. She's doing pretty good on her food and vitamins, but I do need to get her some toys soon because she has been tearing up her toys lately. Gas. I don't stuff gas that much, but I will be putting $10 into gas this week. So now gas has a 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, and $80 in gas. My tank is finally getting low. Um, so for those of you who are new, I just recently got a new car. I, I'm just gonna say new car because it's new, it's new to me. So if it's new to you, it's a new car, okay? Um, yes, I just recently got a new car because I had to junk my old car at the beginning of this year. So I pretty much went the entire year of 2023 without a car. And yes, yeah, so I was very blessed. I was able to get another car and I have not yet had to put a full tank of gas in it. And it's been about a month now since I've had it, but also I injured myself. So I don't really have anywhere I need to go, you know? Okay, food, also known as groceries, will be getting $75. Let's see, perfect, 75. And then let's see what we have left in here. I just, I usually keep all of the, the rollover money in the envelopes that I have for the most part. Like I don't do the dollar challenges or anything like that because I don't really spend cash. I spend all the money on my credit card and then I pay it off with the cash in these cash envelopes. That's just how I prefer to do it um, because I'm a credit card person. A lot of people are not credit card people, so I don't want to necessarily recommend what I am doing, but um, it works for me. It's been working out well. I haven't experienced any negative effects, so because I have not experienced any negative effects, I'm going to keep doing it, you know? <laughs> anyway, so groceries has 50, 70, 75, 80, 85, and 86 dollars. And then I'm skipping fast food, my poor fast food envelope. Some of you are probably wondering, Lambo, why do you even have that envelope? Just let me dream, okay? Let me dream. <laughs> Laundry. <laughs> Laundry will be getting um, $10. So now Laundry has $20. 
you guys at my apartment complex the hot water situation has been a hot mess the water situation in general has been such a hot mess um i swear you guys as soon as the winter came they like weren't prepared or something i don't even know but yeah i haven't had hot water for like two days now and uh today marks the third day that i haven't had hot water today's sunday and then allegedly they're supposed to come fix it tomorrow on monday but they've said that like the past two times this has happened so stay tuned we are now in my pink binder and uh, we have to skip a lot of these categories and move on over to the apartment category because my silly self, I'm going to be putting $35 in there. I broke my vacuum, you guys. I broke the vacuum that I have and it's been broken for like three weeks now at this point, if I'm being honest with you guys. And I really need to get a new vacuum because I do have a lot of furry friends with me and I am allergic to them. <laughs> I am allergic to them. Um, so yes and i take like allergy medicine on a daily for them luckily i haven't experienced any negative effects from all of the hair but once i start to experience effects it goes hard so yes hopefully by the end of this week or next week i will have a new vacuum but stay tuned because vacuums are expensive you guys Anyways, apartment now has 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, and 90 dollars, which should be enough because me and Jay are going to split it. So yeah, that sh hopefully should be enough, you guys. Honestly, I can't spend more than that, so it we're going to make it enough, okay? And toiletries is getting $5, of course, so now it has 50, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 101, 2, 3, 4, and 105. And I definitely need some toiletries, so this will be going down pretty soon as well. And last but not least, we will go into my sparkly binder. And wow, can we just have a moment of silence, you guys, for <laughs> this first envelope and honestly the only envelope I've really been stuffing in this whole binder for the past month or so. Um, yes, I just recently got my car fixed one of two to three uh, <laughs> uh what are they called mechanic shops yeah one of two to three uh mechanic shop visits that my car will need to have but yes it is empty we are starting fresh but it's okay i'm blessed everything's gonna be good so Let's go ahead. I also need to redo all of these envelopes because I don't know. Okay, so right now my car envelope is divided into two different sections. The one in front of this, uh, what is this called? Post-it note is the car maintenance. And then the money behind this car envelope is, or not car envelope, this post-it note is for car insurance. I... Like, as I was saving up to get the car that I have now, or, I, yeah, as I was, like, saving up slash waiting for the car to come, I decided that I was going to save up enough money to hopefully get a year's worth of car insurance, and I was able to do that, so I'm very blessed. So, yeah, I took the L, I paid the year's worth of car insurance, so now we are saving for next year's car insurance. And before I was cash stuffing it, like the past three videos, I was cash stuffing the car insurance money. But then I decided I just didn't want to do that anymore. So basically what I'm going to do is once a month, I'm going to stuff the car insurance section of my car envelope and it will be a $100 placeholder, but that money will be in a high yield savings account. 
just because I don't know I don't really want to take out the car insurance money especially since I'm going to have to wait a year anyways before I'll need it so that's just a long-winded explanation to say I put $25 a week usually towards my car insurance and so technically this week I would add 25 but I already had 75 so yeah I deposited that money and now I have $100 in a car insurance money for next year and then I also have a $100 placeholder for car maintenance. So now I have $100 for car insurance and $100 for car maintenance. So, yeah. And I will be getting paid soon. Thank goodness. <laughs> the struggle is real. Anyways, that's going to be everything for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, of course, consider hitting that like and subscribe button. I'm here three days a week. And when I'm not here, I'm on TikTok, Instagram, Shorts, and in the comment section down below. Of course, if you've made it this far, let's go ahead and put a um, coffee cup emoji because I am sipping on quite a large a uh, caffeinated beverage this morning <sighs> anyways that of course is gonna do it and as usual i will see all of you guys in the next one peace